Captain's Log, start date 59752.4. A failed transport left us stranded on a seemingly deserted planet. There seems to be a strong magnetic shield on this planet, leaving my communicator unusable. Contacting the Enterprise may be an issue. Captain Enterprise. Lieutenant Cancel, do you copy me? <sighs> I immediately begin gathering whatever organic carbon matter I find in hopes of possibly constructing a shelter, or at least a fire. Then, I move on to my training regimen, so as to stay in top physical condition in order to combat whatever hardships I may or may not encounter. Being a type A planet, there's a good chance that this unholy rock may contain some consumable food source. Luckily, my scanner wasn't damaged in the transport. It's passed the first test. I haven't died. The aliens that control this star system appear to be subjugating the native inhabitants in some sort of primitive force field. Those cowardly monsters. This is indeed a landscape of endless contrast, at certain places barren and desolate, and at others vibrant and teeming with color. It is hot all day long here, and it appears as if the sun never once has ever set on this entire planet. Longing and desperation begin to take hold. I begin to wonder if the gods are mocking me from upon their perch within the sky. I wonder, shall I ever leave this unholy, desolate rock? Am I doomed, doomed forever? My only hope is Lieutenant Cancel and Dr. Johnson discover my coordinates before it's too late. Captain Watson, over.